Uh, okay, this is now Five Minute Tarot, episode four. And um, I'd, I'd like to mention again uh, the new site, dynamictarot.com, where you'll find two free video courses or series, one on getting to know the tarot and a second one on how to read a past, present and future spread. So take a look at those videos. And also there's a sign up for the newsletter form at the bottom of the screen. So if you want to be um, kept informed about tarot developments, um, sign up there. It needs an email address. Um, okay, so uh, today I was thinking sometimes people want to know who am I going to marry or what kind of person is this? And we might think or we might pre like a court card, a king, a queen, a knight or a page to answer that question, but really any card will do. And um, so here we've got, here's one, for instance, the two battens. Okay. Right, we've got the fellow standing on top of the turret, top of the castle, and he's looking out into the distance. So what kind of person is this? We're looking at the card to get an idea of the strengths and weaknesses, the personality type that the, the, the individual is. So here we've got somebody probably successful because that's him or her on top of the, uh, the battlements, wearing the cape and holding the world in his hand and looking out into the distance. So somebody who who is has been successful, who has goals, who has plans, and who's maybe look at, who who looks into the future to get an idea of where he wants to go or where she wants to go and what direction she wants to go in or he wants to go in. Okay, so it's not the kind of person who just does things because they feel like it, whether it's a good idea or not. They don't do things on impulse. So this is more likely to be somebody who is self-controlled, self-disciplined, who thinks things through, who decides on what the final outcome he or she wants is going to be, and then figures out, okay, this is where I want to go. How am I going to get there? Right, so um, also the fact that he's standing on top of the turret of the castle, probably successful, right? So um, he, this is a person of experience, right? So if they're in a particular job, they've been there for a while, or they've got special skill, or they've developed skills and ability, abilities over the years, maybe they've also got some kind of qualif academic qualification that enabled them to take the job in the first place. So I'm thinking of somebody, let's say, in in real estate. So they've got a broker, a broker's certificate or whatever you call it. Um, they've sold property. They've sold to different people, different levels of income, right? And so maybe this, the 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 fact that he's standing on top of the battlements would indicate that if they're in real estate, then they sell to well-heeled people. You know, they sell million-dollar homes and up or expensive office space rather than first-time buyers who've got a couple hundred thousand dollars to spend and they want to buy a used townhouse, right? So we're getting an idea about the type of people that this individual mingles with or does business with or hangs around with. Um, there's always more to say, but I'm going to stop now. Um, I was looking at the clock there. And I don't. It's, I forgot to. I always forget to look at the clock at the, when I start this, so I never know how long I'm going for. But it's supposed to be short and to the point. So that's it for today. Tomorrow will be another card. Okay. Thank you very much. Bye bye.